Hi all, welcome to this course in PPC. Today we'll be learning about the evaluation of ERP. Enterprise Resource Plan. So ERP, which we are utilizing in this latest days, are generally made up of softwares, which gives off the data once we give the input to them. But this standardization or this development has come with a lot of development and it has an evolution where the enterprise software landscape has undergone a sea change in the past decades or so. By the mid of 1990, ERP solutions leaped out from the manufacturing units to the other sector or departments covering key functions such as maintenance, after sales, inventory, human resources, e-commerce, etc. As of today, ERP systems are available with advanced functionalities, features, and usability than ever. Hence, this evolution of technology based upon the demands is what we'll be learning under this evolution. That is, the evolution of ERP started with the beginning in the 1980s with aim or which aimed at big businesses which helped the accounting and the finances or to look after the accounting and the finances we utilized this ERP in the starting stage. These systems were very expensive and very complex to use also during that time. Then came our modular and lightweight infra where these types of micro ERP system which took over the complex and the large enterprise systems by breaking them into smaller modular components or smaller systems came into utilization. Finally, in 1990s, the interfunctional ERP integrations came into existence where this system seamlessly integrated the accounting, distribution, inventory, logistics, and so on. And finally, in the 21st centuries, we have the ERP ecosystem which witnessed the introduction of several add-ons like supply chain, the business intelligence, smart reporting, and CRM, and so on. And now, or the latest technology which we use today is cloud computing or ERP system have a long way today these have come with built-in intelligent integrated systems faster updates cloud for mobile friendly data driven and modular hence the total history of ERP is as follows in 1966 1960s the inventory management and control was done 1970s the material requirement planning was done 1980s, MRP2 or Manufacturing Requirement Planning was done. 1990s, Enterprise Resource Planning came into existence. 2000s, the web functionalities with Internet of ERP2 came into existence. And finally, now the cloud-based ERP, which is the latest technology, is being used after 2010. So this is how the evolution of ERP is being done. And based upon this ERP, Based upon the evolution, how it started and how it has reached up till now, what are the different aspects which are present is what we'll be learning here. That is, in the initial stages, we directly found out the economic order quantity or the reorder point manually. As 1970 started, we started with the MRP or material requirement plan. Then we started with the manufacturing resource planning, which came into the management and accounting field based upon this MRP2 and finally in the 1980s the manufacturing resource planning came into existence and then the ERP system evaluated which evolved which was done in 1990s which is generally called as the MRP2 as Y2K started or taking over of information technology on, in the world started we started with the software as a service which gave a profound change in the field of this ERP and with the introduction of big data also, we completely changed the way we look into this accounting systems or the entire planning system. Thank you.